hey guys it's phase one once again with another video today we got some more files in regards to now the medical gameplay um for 314 i'm not sure if it actually released with 314 i believe it will be 315 but i think um these are just the files that the star citizen least discord channel was able to uh provide to us um, all right if you're new to this channel you haven't subscribed already make sure you subscribe we do all kinds of star citizen content we are doing a giveaway for the nova tank if you want to participate i'll leave the link to that video in the description below all right so let's get right into it um so from the files that they're finding uh med pen oxy pen the cure life medical gun okay so they have that in a cure life medical vial so there'll be a vial obviously that you'll use to um you have to ins you have to attach it to the medical medical gun in order to use it okay you are downed okay i think so when somebody gets severely hurt instead of dying immediately maybe you'll be you'll go into a down state and then somebody could come and actually um and actually start healing you with the cure life medical gun or the med the med pen itself or um the um the attachment with the multi-tool interesting okay so you are overdose so you can overdose okay so there's i like the fact that you can overdose that means skill is required you have to know what you're doing interesting um hold action player incapacitated respawn on at so of course if you overdose you could kill the person okay time to retrieval time until death okay so when a person when you're working on a person there will be a time i guess you'll it'll maybe the the medical gun will tell you how long you have until that person is completely dead okay there's an unconscious state so there's a down state and there's an unconscious state that the player character will probably be exhibiting in in the mechanic interesting i like that um registered clones okay i guess respawning they're going to be adding clone the cloning system inside of respawning um so i guess in instead of respawning i guess you'll you're respawning in a clone of yourself it says last clone okay interesting patient procedures so th this is the admin office obviously at the medical off the 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 um the, the the hospitals itself all right remove selected calliope admin oh maybe there might be a a medical office at calliope interesting when uh, change your clone location so i guess this is sort of like a respawn point so instead of like the stations or the major locations you can just spawn is directly at the hospitals instead which makes sense so if you die in game i think maybe when you log in you'll log in in the abs but if you die mid game you'll wake up um at a hospital which makes perfect sense i like that history i guess they're gonna be keeping histories of players the amount of times you die insurance insurance if you die okay so if you die and you respawn as a clone maybe you'll have to pay an insurance and maybe the insurance will cover your personal gear is, is that what is that how that's gonna work i'm curious to find out more on that um location release clone calliope clone so yeah it looks like there will be a, a spawn point at calliope Let's transfer clone please clear the area what is that a uh, medical professional has been notified your patience is in good hands okay so when you heal somebody and i guess when you heal them you can heal them up to a certain point and then maybe they'll get picked up and taken to the hospital i don't know how that's gonna work if they're gonna be despawned and wake up in the hospital but that's what i'm getting from this patient ready drop off yeah i guess there'll be a drop off mechanic interesting i like this 
uh place patient in the mark zone oh so you are you're you're gonna have to pick people up and take them to the hospitals and drop them off they're either npcs or real players that's really nice i like that oh man a lot of people that are into medical gameplay is really gonna love this man they're really gonna love this interesting um emergency drop off uh please touch the screen to check in patients so you'll have to check in the patient so i wonder once you check them in maybe it'll pay you maybe the insurance will pay you for making them in i don't know how that's gonna work but I, I, I'm sure there will be a payment system for those that save them. It will literally introduce a new career path, which is really cool. Um, amount, drugs, duration, head. All right, so these are the healing. The parts that you can heal on the body, it looks like. Medication, non-selected. Form surgery. Whoa, <laughs> there's going to be surgery in this. This is crazy interesting man this is gonna be deep procedure so it's gonna be a procedure that i guess you, those, there's gonna be different procedures to select from in terms of performing the surgery it is really cool um safety mode okay please select one or more yeah it's gonna be multiple procedures man this is gonna be really cool so players are gonna be performing these procedures that is really cool interesting Tier one medical. Calliope medical. Okay. Maybe the Calliope medical will actually be on you, Babbage. Is maybe that's maybe it's just called Calliope Medical. I don't think it'll be on the moon itself. Um torso. You're unconscious. Your consciousness has been transferred to a new body. So this is the re the new respawn point. We're gonna be respawning as new clones when we die. Interesting. I like that. Description of clone insurance. I wonder what's going to be covered in the insurance. I'm curious to see. Loan me. Okay, so you get to select. Continue. Please find your courtesy flight suit and helmet in adjacent locker. Okay, so you wake up as a clone. You'll probably just be in your boxers and then you, you will have your flight suit to go pick up. It'll give you a courtesy flight suit. And then when you leave from there, then you, especially when physical inventory comes in, you'll need to go to a location where you have access to your flight suits and then get your normal flight suit. That is interesting. I like that. That's, that's a lot of depth. All right. Nice. You are experiencing a medical emergency. Interesting. Hmm. Sorry about that. My daughters are playing and they like to yell. Um, recover and clone activation fee has been covered by UEE Empire Health Services. Okay, so maybe depending on your, the kind of insurance you have, you'll be you'll get coverage. Description of healing. Okay, heal me. Can you? How can we help you today? Okay, so you can walk into a hospital itself if you need healing, if you're able to make it there yourself. I guess. Description of admin, uh, manage my Calliope network, only visible to admin, recommended options. Please select an option to avoid death. Interesting. Welcome back. Welcome to Calliope. Welcome to, please touch the screen to get your room allocation. So when you do check yourself in, there's a, there'll be a room that you'll have to go to. Oh, that's cool, man. So I wonder if players would have the option to literally stay in the hospital and just be a person that just heals people and perform these procedures at the location at the hospitals that would be really cool that, that's a really cool profession so there'll be people that would be bringing people like like the ems or the ambulance and, and, and deliver them make sure that they're still in good state and then once they arrive at the hospital maybe a player will be there to also help as as a doctor to perform the, the, the procedures or the uh, surgeries to get them back up. And if they don't make it, then they'll spawn into a clone. That's what I'm getting from all of this. Check in, please proceed to welcome. Interesting, interesting. I like this, man. You guys let me know your thoughts on this in the comments below. Once again, if you haven't subscribed already, make sure you do. All right, there will be more videos coming. So uh, make sure you look out for that. All right, I will see you on the next one.